Hi, it's Brittany with Lectin Free Kitchen. I'm talking to you about lectin. We're a lectin free kitchen and we believe in a lectin free lifestyle and way of eating. But so many times we get the question, what is lectin? And it's a great question. I definitely recommend reading Dr. Stephen Gundry's Plant Paradox book to learn more. But he actually calls lectins LPS little pieces of shit. <laughs> and the reason is because when you have lectin in your body, it's just going to cause total chaos in your body. It sets off alarms that actually tell your body that your body needs to go to war. And that's one of the reasons why uh, you'll find that those who eat a higher lectin content of food could be overweight, um, possibly obese, because their body is at war and war takes a lot of energy, right? So you're, you know, wanting to consume more and more and more food to battle with this war going on within your body. It's one of the reasons why obesity is at an all-time high now versus what it was in the future because in the past our body didn't have to go at war with itself. We consumed food that was good for us, but nowadays when you walk through the grocery store, everything that you find is almost going to have lectin in it if you're eating these prepackaged foods and you're not doing your research. So it's really important to know what is good for your body, what you should and shouldn't be eating, and how you can become the healthiest version of yourself. We love sharing these fun facts with you, especially when it comes to having a good healthy gut, which means a good healthy brain and the best lifestyle that you can have, um, as well as eating and living long and healthy lives. So subscribe and we'll share many more videos on these same topics.